Hello to the few people who actually watch these videos. We're doing Dishonored again. I actually am setting up a capture card so I can start streaming some of the games I grew up playing on the Wii. So this is going to be a lot of fun. And also messing with getting my game data from this computer onto my dad's old computer because he's getting a new one. If you haven't been watching my Minecraft streams, which is like everyone hasn't, just like, like two views, two, yeah, whatever, whatever, who cares? I'm still figuring this out. Let's go. But yeah, so my dad's getting a new computer, which means I'm getting his old computer, which is a lot better and stronger than this computer, which means I should be able to stream again, which will be nice. And then I'll have the capture, then I'll reset up the capture card on that computer, because right now I'm setting it up on this computer as a trial run to kind of figure out how everything works and stuff. So until then, bear with me, because I don't know what the crap I'm doing. All right, let's get back into this. Let's let's go be scoundrels, assassins. Oh, there's a hair on the microphone. Just, I don't know if that was really loud. I hope it wasn't. There's a hair on it. Okay. The royal physician. Where? You've been asked to abduct Anton Sokolov, the royal physician and head of the Academy of Natural Thrists. A mysterious ally and one of his most powerful noble supporters. Sokolov lies in a large apartment somewhere atop Caldwin's Bridge. Alright. Okay, let me just like... Okay. Walk. Crouch is C because this game is cool. Okay, then we hold F. Okay. And, then, and then we jump. And then we lean. And then we lean the other way. Okay, I figured out the, the controls once more. I believe... Next thing I'm supposed to do is talk to Sammy. Hello there, Sammy. Off to Caldwin's Bridge, sir. We'll get our sleep later. Yep. Sleep on the boat. Let's go. Just climb aboard when you're ready. Creepy mask, I love it. <laughs> Guess the music cut off. We didn't get to hear the dramatic. Whatever happens in the sound soundtrack. Yep. Okay. What do you think, Corvo? Caldwin Bridge. You've been in the city for years, but you lived in Dunwall Tower with the late Empress, so maybe you haven't visited the bridge before tonight. Something to look out for. See all them lights on the water? That's right. We'll be spotted for sure. You're gonna have to shut off their power before I can pick you up. Now, about bringing Sokolov back alive, he's smart. Maybe even smarter than Piero. Got the whole of Dunwall under his thumb with all that natural philosophy business. New technology, potions and the like. Seems dangerous to me. But what do I know? Here we are. Ah. I'll meet you at the arches under Sokolov's place when you're ready, Corvo. Assuming, of course, you've taken care of those floodlights. Let's go. Also... Then what? Do we say something? Remind them about curfew? No. You don't remind them. You chase them down, and you give them a severely deadly beating is what. You guys are terrible okay, guards. Okay, yeah, I got it. Let's see. Oh, I can go up here. Beating. Nice. Uh, oh, I, I, thought, I thought I fell. Don't mind me, I don't know what I'm doing. I apologize if I ran Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the region, the curfew is now active. No loud along Caldwin Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. I forgot I didn't have this equipped in. I can follow that. It's right here.
Here we are. I'll meet you at the Arches under Sokolov's place when you're ready. Assuming, of course, you understand now. Yes. Curfew means ain't nobody okay, allowed let's to try be this again. wandering about. So now I know. Okay, so yeah, I know. Words, I know. He's probably gonna walk over here. And then what when he does, he's gonna come out like I do because I am a stealthy, stealthy ninja. Remind him about curfew? No. You don't remind him. You chase him down. And you give him a severely deadly beat. Because y'all are terrible people. Alright. Open heart. Yeah, what you got? I, I smell bones in the pylons. Blood beneath, beneath the stone, stone locks. locks. Die building structure. You're probably citizens and visitors to our city. By order, no foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Corvo, stop Attention, all citizens. People. No Holy pedestrian crap. movement like, allowed along like, Caldwin's oh Bridge Check during this period. Curfew will end right tomorrow in. morning. At sunrise. But they ran, they just got a good name. Sorry, man. Man has a lot of weird jokes. It's also practically a cult, so like. Yeah. Ha! You little bastard. Uh, you are a mean person. I don't like you, so you are next. My unconscious seems. I don't know what's now. Can't do anything when you lean! Like, sir, sir! I need a bottle! Oh, I need bottles. I need something to make the man move. I shoot the floor. That could be a bad idea, though. Also, apparently they don't look up before the store. and visitors to our city. By order of the region, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens. No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise.
Yes. Okay. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the Regent, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens, no pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. I'm smart, guys. Even like if you think I'm smart. <laughs> oh gosh, if I do that, I'm just gonna get a bunch of dislikes. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay, but yeah, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. Tell me what the crap you want me to keep doing in this game, because I don't know what I'm doing, and I also keep forgetting how to play the game. Oh, I thought that was a person. It was just a board. Is that a door? Who knows? Let's open it. I was part of the thing. It looked like an open door, but it was like really short, and so I was. I. Okay, I stepped in something or some junk, and I don't like the noise it made. I am still squatting. Let's go. Wait, I heard some. By order of the Regent, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew Stop is talking. lifted. Attention all times. citizens. No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise.
I'll come back for you, you're fine. You're fabulous. Citizens and visitors to our city. Okay. By order of the region, the curfew I guess this is, is now about. active. Oh, yes, it is. No okay. foot traffic is allowed across Oakland's Bridge until the curfew clock. is lifted. Attention all citizens, no pedestrian movement is allowed Wait. along Caldwin's ah. Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at Let's sunrise. Go. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the Regent, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens, no pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. Nope, that didn't work. Oh. Oh. Sleep. Guys, I'm so good at this game. I, I'm so good. I, such a good job. I'm so sneaky. I am self. There were two people here. There's technically two again, but um, um, um. Okay. Y'all, no, do they wake up? I don't think they wake up. Okay, three guys. Y'all, gen gently, gently. I have seven left. Oh yeah, just that. A lot easier. Okay, so I still want to know what's in there. Seek the bridge for solace. Ruined men, abandoned women, and plague victims have all left from here. Citizens and visitors to our city, by order of the region, the curfew is now person. active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Attention all citizens. Okay. 
No pedestrian movement is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. Curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. People are disappearing. Dead bodies is phased out of existence. What the frick? I've given up. I don't believe I'll find any more people. I say that that I'm full percent knowing full well I might end up running into something and then the voice will listen to again. But who cares? Save up for roots. Okay, 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 okay. Important information. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna do that. Okay! Uh, Curse the plague and this blasted uh, curfew. How was. Uh, well, now, Mr. Pratchett, even a wealthy man like you needs the city watch. Gangs are cutting throats and smashing windows left and right, and the weepers, excuse me, the plague victims are worse. Are you saying the Lord Regent is wrong for imposing curfew? It won't do you any good to bait me, officer. But don't worry, I'll be fine. I'll profit. A smart man can come out ahead, even in the time of plague. Sure, like that Sokolov. He's doing fine. Always a lot of exotic items coming and going from his place. Keeps this place running, at least for now. Yes, yes, if by exotic you mean foul-smelling as a witch's bottle. The royal physician will be fine too, until he crosses the wrong man. Can you stop talking and go about there? Walk cycles.
slaughterhouse is the whale slaughterhouse. Here we go. So seven three. It's seven three. I know. others. Rivers change course over many lifetimes, and eventually all bridges tumble down. A thousand years ago, there was another city on this spot. The people carved the bones of whales into runes and inscribed them with my mark. Children still find them washed up in the river mud. Anton Sokolov has made a great study of my runes, but he's not special like you are. He wasn't chosen, and he doesn't wear my mark so he can't unlock their secrets. Sokolov believes there are specific words and acts that can compel me to appear before him. He searches old temples in Pendicia and ruined sub-basements in the flooded district. He performs disgusting rituals beneath the old abbey. But if he really wants to meet me, he could start by being a bit more interesting.
Drawbridge Way, the Midrow Substation, and the North End. Fancy. That's all that was. But it was blowing, and it looked fancy, and it was kind of helpful. Also, there's too many ways to go. I want to see them all, but I can't. Show yourself. Probably messing up the Wake and up. Then we got some low life breaking. Oh crap! This Someone skulking around. Empress. Yeah, I didn't. 
kill no one. Or excuse you. Excuse me, princess.
me and making the noise and I don't like it. It's a dramatic music cue. Got lucky.
still around. Someone wants to get hurt. What? Any fools settled in over here? Picked up anything good? Shut up! No time to blow a cloud. We got some cloud. And around, like the cycle of life. <coughs> Such a wondrous symbol of the progress we've made in industry and invention. If you say so, sir. And remember, guardsmen, we must make sure they keep turning. It would look very bad on your record. Very bad indeed, should the factory shut down in your watch. Yes, sir. I'm not 
off because now everyone's unconscious. They didn't have to kill them that time. But who cares? At this point, it's too late. Let's go. Time to turn that off, or else I will die. And I think it's gonna that thing. So we gotta go around. Oh, well, we gotta go through the big old wheel. Oh, that's why I had to turn it off. Corvo, I know you can jump that high. Weird face. I forgot what he looked like. I just know he had a weird face. There's his house. I wish there was a way. Is there? What the fuck is he? No, sadly, I cannot shoot the light out. In the Metro Check series, under you can. I'm gonna find you. Yeah, I just. Where you are. Is. Let the guards know I was here. Body. A 
Okay, here we go. It's a stash. Higgins, I recently got a tip about a stash hidden at the north end of Caldwin's Bridge. Another crazy idiot keeping all his shiny stuff in a secret room. I was told you need to turn on the faucet in the old sink three times to open up some kind of secret door. No information on the value of what's in the room. I only heard about a street speaker hanging over the road. Just outside the door. Sorry about that, mate. Don't forget my share if you find it. He's dead, so I'm going to keep his share. So there's a street speaker hanging over the road. Oh, would you look at that? That looks fun. Uh, no, 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 sir. Not, not thinking. Okay. I was just wondering if Sokolov is testing the elixir to okay. cure the plague. Why so, so the north end of Caldwich. Cald. Natural philosophy. Obviously, it's because the ones already sick with plague don't live long enough to provide Sokolov with any useful information. It's just a shame, is all. Like that woman the other day. She was easy to look at. Seemed nice enough. Shame she has to die. I mean, it's so horrible, like, too. Now you listen to me. It's none of our concern the how or why of things. And if you want your elixir rations, then I suggest you stop your wondering. These are pigs. Pigs for Sokolov's experiments. And pigs mean nothing. Understand? Right, right. Right. Me I mean, why worry All about the others? All pigs get slaughtered sooner or later. Better if I want them not to. Help! Just die! Firing! <laughs> Damn you! Clear the line! Take that! <laughs> Hope the night treats you well, Corvo. I'll be here when you have what you came for. Okay, I just need to lay low for a bit, like everyone saw. Yeah, I'll flush you out. There they are. I need to get to civilized places across the way. Can't stay hidden forever. Oh, there's that guy. Ran off. Coward. I'll find you. The screams are evidence that I have done my job. We. The screams are evidence we have done our job. You know, guardsmen, I don't care for you very much. Okay. Oh, I can't go.
going backwards. You go this way. This is where you go. So I think you'll get your own squad oh, after what happened last there. night. Chances are very good. Hello? Try that again? If you say so. Good. Okay. Okay, good. So we have those sketchy dudes. They're creepy as heck magic boxes. That I don't like.
Hi. Okay. Turn my hopes and energies to Formula 24, which, in conjunction with a high heat therapy, which came to me most vividly in a dream last night. Whoever you are, he kept me in a cage, like an animal. The pain is horrible right now, so I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. Oh, that might not be the best idea, but okay, you do you. Let's try to get the Sammy just down there. It should be too hard, I'll just jump on the rooftops. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Hello, sir. That was awesome, plus. Spread out. There's been word of a ruckus. No details yet. Okay. Almost there. There we go. Okay. Sam, go out. Just leave. I have so glove. The royal physician himself. You made a neat job of it. Drop him here, and we'll be off. Awesome. There's something around there, but whatever. Okay, yeah, I was very much detected. I killed a lot of people. But the overall chaos lighting was low, and that's good. I... I killed a civilian? I didn't know I killed a civilian. I thought I just knocked her out. Yeah, I was able to get that, but it's fine. Shh, it's fine. Uh, let's go. I might replay some of those and try to get... and try and go for, like, the ghost mode. But I'm not going to do that right now.
set up a cell for Sokolov in the old kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock, him waking up in the straw and old dog poop. But from what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have at that. Um, okay. Well done, Corvo. Well done. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in the shadows. The Royal Physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machines. He could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with a tyrant. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. Okay, nap time. I might have a weird dream sequence, but nap time. Actually, yeah. Let's go find him. So you're gonna just take Corvo? Not Corvo, I'm Corvo. Whatever, Sokolov will find his way to his chains. Where's Emily? Also, Piero next week. Normally... I'm a natural philosopher, but today, consider me a humble craftsman here to serve. I... You feel like an annoying person. Oh, nice. I have a boot upgrade. I'm stealthier. Nice. Definitely gonna do that. Okay. I think that's all I want from there. Oh, I don't want to do Okay. Nice. Thank you. Okay. Attention so citizens. Let us go to bed. I might possibly find Emily along the way, but who knows? I have no idea where she went. She's in here somewhere. Two of our city's I best and brightest. The Lord's. Ooh. Six valuables. I'll this will just leave their valuables about with Corvo over here. Mr. Like pickpocket, go extraordinaire. Hello, madam. Sir, do you need help? Can I walk into the door? Also, can I take these? I cannot take those. He doesn't care that I'm just taking his stuff. By respecting the property and rights of others in these trying times and preserving the. Oh, whoops. The beauty of our fair okay. city. He's just standing there disapprovingly looking around the room. Okay. Yeah, Emily is somewhere. Somebody. Let's go to bed. Here's a room. Close the door. I love how we, we just we get our own entire floor. Also, I'm gonna go over here. I feel like Emily's in that tower. I'm positive. Also, this feels precarious, sketchy, and structurally unsound. Unsound. Please be as quiet as you can. It took forever for Emily to fall asleep. Oh, okay. Poor dear. Oh. It's okay, Emily, I'm here. She seems happier when you're here. Though I know you have important things to do. Out there, in the city. Sweet poor child. Please, please leave a candle for me. I... It's dark in here, and I, I can't see my mother. I just want a candle. Where is Corvo? Oh, that poor sweet child. She's been through so much. I'm just gonna take whatever I can. Can I sleep here? Can I make sure the child is safe? Sweet, sweet child. Sweet baby. No! Mother, run! No! Corvo! <gasps> oh, that poor child! Sweet poor child! Ah! Okay, it, it honestly breaks my heart that she's just barely able to have all that. <laughs> just, eh. I can't make words, I make noises. That, that poor, poor child. Sweet little Emily. Did not deserve any of that bull crap. Also, who takes, her, who takes a child to a brothel for safekeeping? 
I mean, seriously. Why? Nice. There was just some there. But still, like, who thought it was a good idea to hide Emily in a brothel? Attention, Dunwall citizens. Like, nah, bro, nah. Ooh. This matter with my brothers has not been pleasant at all, so I don't wish to discuss it further. However, I really must thank you. I've heard that you found some other means of neutralizing them without taking their lives. Ingenious. Wherever they are, even if they are miserable, they are alive at least, so perhaps won't someday I will see them again. Thank you. Okay, time to go to sleep. And be sad that Emily... Oh, that poor child. Okay. Interrogation. The royal physician Anton Sokolov is now in the custody of the loyalists. Through Sokolov, it will be possible to strike directly at those closest to the Lord Regent. How cooperative will the most brilliant man in the Empire be? He must be swayed or coerced into telling what he knows. Okay, so it's been an hour and a half. Wake up! You were making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. That was smart. That was very smart. Callista will come get me when she's done with her bath. Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. You would always welcome your sweet, sweet child. Oh gosh. Okay, I... Oh, oh, she draws. Drawing it made of you without your scary mask, and it says, Daddy, I was right! Also, I mean, she tried. Look at that collar. It's actually pretty good. I mean, the eyes are a little lopsided. And, like, that hair is coming out of nowhere. Like, you want to put it in the part when it comes down. But, like, that's pretty good for some random kid who I don't think draws too often. But, like, look at that. That's really sweet. Also, I was right. Corvo was her father. But she calls him Corvo instead of Daddy. What she wrote Daddy on the picture. <gasps> it's really sweet. What a pure sweet child. Okay, we're going to end it here with Emily being adorable. My favorite character. The redeeming character of this game. Emily. Okay, we're going to end it here. Since it's been an hour and a half. And I don't want this to run super, super long. So, next week I will be playing... I think if I can get the capture card to work, I'm going to be doing Twilight Princess, the HD version, because I've never beaten that version of the game before. I have beaten the original version like six times throughout my life because I love that game so much. But yeah, I'm going to be doing the HD version on the Wii if I can handle the weird mirrored version and the different controls. And I'll be doing that next week, hopefully if I get the capture card to work. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Tell me what you guys want to see me do next. What game do you want me to keep playing? Do you want me to do The Long Dark with Radio more? Do you want me to play more of Far Cry with Twisted? Do you want me to do more just chill, silent Minecraft streams? With the lag horribly- oh, uh, terrible. Do you want me to do more of this game? Because I do actually like this game and I do want to beat it. I also have a lot of other games. And if you want, like, oh, hey, we aren't super interested in watching this game, do you should choose a different one, or hey, you should play this game in the future. I will make a list, and I will get that game, because I want to know what you guys want me to do. Because, like, I have fun doing practically whatever, and I don't know what you guys are going to have fun watching me do, and, and stuff. And eventually I'll have a new editor, editor, so these videos will be a little more fun. There's a thing on the wall. Let's read that real fast. Corvo, thank you for getting me a live weeper. This is going to be invaluable for my old friend at the Academy of Natural Philosophy. So living plague specimens are quite difficult to procure. Rest assured, my colleague will handle the situation as, humanly, as humanely as possible. Nice, and I have two more sleep darts. Thanks, Piero. Okay, yeah, so we are going to end it here. Y'all have a nice life. Like, comment, subscribe. Who is, okay, comment, who is your favorite character in this game? So far, who's your favorite character? Is it Campbell? Is it Soup? Soup Man? Is it Sketchy Guy? I'm saying these names because I can't remember their actual names, and all of you are going to be very confused. Is it Emily, Sweet Pure Child? Is it, what's her name, Callisto, the lady who's actually taking care of her? Is it Corvo? Emily's father? Is it the emo outsider man? Is it Lady Rags? She is terrifying. But I'd probably say she's like in my top three char favorite characters, being Corv Emily first, Corvo, 
Lucas Corvos just seems like a great guy. And then, like... You, you're gonna break my heart. You're gonna take...